Hello and welcome back to Fort Triumph with me, Barden. Okay, we're going to take on, I think, these two fights. Then we'll have a look at what we can do with the castle. Actually, let's have a look at that first. So, I don't accidentally do that. Oh, there we are. Okay, so we can, we can get ourselves a plot. We've got our town hall at the moment. We could get some heroes. Um... Camp. Okay, so we have to build more stuff there for that. We could get infantry slot one. We don't have enough of those though for that. Okay. Okay, so I think they changed. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think they might change what these things cost. Maybe there was there were always that, but there was I think it was a time when they cost beats. But we're working towards these anyway. Let's go to a fourth then, and we can. Oh, and all the plots cost the same. But did, does the price change when we start building, maybe? Yeah, it does. Look, each plot costs more as you build. Okay, so we got a plot there. <coughs> and then when we can, we'll build something up, up here. So we can go for the university for 400. Infirmary for 750 or the stable for 700. Okay, so the university might be the first one that we do. We'll certainly be able to afford the first at least. Okay, so we've seen that bit now. Let's get on with the fighting. Okay, let's battle these guys. So the first battle we're going to have in this playthrough where we have four in our party. Okay. So, we got three dudes there. Okay, so you can go there. So we'll start with that. Oh! Okay, luckily you missed. Forgot that those guys automatically start with, um, with Overwatch. Let's do this. There we go. So you're both... Uh, they're both stunned, so they do nothing next turn. Now, I think this guy is going to die. We could just go kill him anyway. Um, but it's going to be more fun to do this. So we'll kick this rock. He'll get hit by it. And then we'll get an attack of opportunity there. There we go. Yep. Okay, and there's the level up as well. Nice. All right, let's see. Could pick it. Let's see what new abilities you have. Healing Aura. That's the one that we want. Okay, then next we probably do that. Okay. But I am excited to see how things are going to work as we work our way through the skill three tree. Um, see, you have 10 hit points left. You have seven. So we're probably not going to kill these guys straight up. So you come here and do that for free. Okay, good hit. And then we can hit you again. Okay, excellent. Then she can move over to here. Kill you or damage you. Let's kill you so then we only have to worry about you and kill you next turn. So you're dead. We definitely, if we didn't want to have a bit of fun, we definitely could have killed them all, I think, in one round. Now, she's leveled up as well, so can we go for new ability? So, telekinesis prod. What does that do? Pussy unit one tile away. Mm. That is that's useful for when so you get you get these things where melee units will move within a tile of your range guys and then they can't use your range ability. So prod would help with pushing them away and then you maybe shoot them with a spell or something to kill them. 
Um, but I think an execute maybe is the one that I want to go for. An execute an enemy causing it damage when it moves. Yeah, let's get that. Okay. I like how there are, there are kind of more selections now because before it was it felt like you you were just kind of following the same the same roadmap every time. Okay, let's end. Okay, he moves over there. Okay, well that's the best he could do, I guess. So he's got seven. Let's start with blinding light. Okay. Then I guess he moves far as there, so you can you can probably kill him next turn. You're gonna go. You go there, because maybe you'll kill him if he tries to move away. Then we can use your new electrocute ability now. So let's let's first of all blink. You. I guess the here is that the closest? I think that's the closest you can get. Then we'll execute you. Oh, oh, you can't see. Damn. You should have moved you over here. Okay. Well, let's move you. Um, you're not going to see them either. Even where we can move you. Let's move you there. Maybe you get lucky and you're able to pull them. 82% chance. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to pull them. It's possible that Krita will get a, an attack of opportunity and kill them. But if not, then she's going to either shoot them or electrocute them. Electrocute them would be the more fun thing to do. But let's see how this works out. There we go. Okay. Killed you. Right. Yeah, that was fun. Got a gray eight plus there now, because mainly I guess because we didn't take any damage. Right, let's keep going. Okay, so we can grab that plate armor then. Increases damage received by one. So we go here then. That, I think, should go on you, because you really should be the person taking the damage. We didn't customize you yet. Um, let's see. Mm. Let's go kind of purplish with you. Okay, that'll do. Now... Let's fight this fight. Now, the thing about kind of going around and trying to fight every fight is that the the difficulty up goes up every week. So you could kind of end up in a position where you're you're fighting really strong enemies that are invading simply because you've been fighting lesser enemies on your own patch. Where are you? You're over there, okay. That one's there. Okay. So. That one's got the overwatch on. We can see that. Okay, so. How does this work for us then? We could maybe pull you out of your overwatch. Yeah, let's do that. Let's pull you out. Here we go. So you're stunned. Then we get a free shot at you. 64%. Okay, that's good. Now. I think then you maybe move back to there. Okay. Then Leandra. OK, 
Okay. 63%, but we're going to try it. Okay. Good, so you're executed. You should die because you're going to try and run all the way up here to us. Then we have these two to worry about. That one might get to you. Mm, let's move you a little bit further away. Okay, and then we're just going to end that turn. Okay, so you move away. We can deal with you. You die from that. Then we want these two just to move closer. Okay. That's good because we can deal with you guys. You don't have your thing again, right? So let's use blinding light on you. Good. Then Krita. He's got four health. You could almost kill him. Well, you could potentially kill him, but if we move you there, you can at least kick him and take care of him that way. So if you move, hmm, not good spots really. Right, let's think of what we're going to do. So, let's start with Critter. Critter can get to you. Let's put Critter there. And hit you with a tree. You're dead. Good. Then you can move to here. Shoot that one. It's now dead. And you've leveled up as well. Great. See, new ability. Oh, we didn't get to choose from knockback that time. Hmm. Because knockback would definitely be the one that I'd choose. Right, let's go grappling box chance to hit is not affected by cover. We did that already, right? Yeah. Then martial target increased in accuracy against it. Upgrade also applies to quick shot. Okay, let's do that. Now there's just that dude over there. So you go to here. Okay. Then do that. Okay, good hit. And then we can move you to there. Okay. Oh, you did a good Good job there. Right. So you got that up again. Yeah. That's on the wrong line, right? There. Yeah, that was the tree. Okay. You could potentially electrocute them. Okay. Then if you go and eat the overwatch, they're going to have to go one, two, and go at least three spaces, but I think they'll probably move somewhere like here. And that will kill them. So you go there. 
get all watched they missed then they're gonna have to move right there you can move up to here you might even all watch them to death anyway but they should be dead now there attack opportunity anyway okay right there we go not bad there took a bit of damage but not really in any danger okay so another win there you get b coins or 25 xp mm. let's go for the b coins this time okay then we can now build oh we can't quite build the university okay we can get our inventory slot upgrade or our shoes increase the speed of the unit by one we'll take that right now because we're not really hurting for inventory because we haven't really got much so let's purchase that so it's going to make us more tactically flexible because we can move that a little bit further on our turns now. Okay, so that fight's going to be easy to do. Mm, and then that one's quite easy as well, right? How about you? You're a little bit of an upgrade, so we might try you at some point. Well, we will try you at some point. Mm, we don't quite know which direction the enemies could be over there or they could be down here. Right, but for now, I think that's where we're going to leave this one. So I hope you have enjoyed and hope to see you all next time. Goodbye. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, maybe consider hitting the subscribe button there on the right or checking out some other videos here on the left. Or perhaps you might even share with some friends.